Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Do you know about the Kawansin lawyer and why we need the Kawansin lawyer to sell the, our property? Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I'm Rosmari Hem binti Harun. Today I would like to talk and, and tell about the uh, Kawansin and why we need to um, we need the Kawansin lawyer to sell our property. Okay. Um, First of all, uh, are you familiar with the common scene? It's okay. To, uh, before I go through with our uh, chosen uh, topic, um, I want uh, to um, uh, share about the meaning of common scene. Common scene is a, a legal um, <coughs> is a legal process of transferring a title of transferring process of a property title from one individual to another individual when we talk about this is uh, <coughs> very close with legal uh, job legal matter when it's come uh, to uh, uh, legal matter it's always best to invest in uh, in the trusted uh, lawyer in Malaysia okay um, to uh, look at the flow chart there are uh, five step and uh, need to complete upon uh, um, to sell your property first of all is the uh, upon and uh, experience agent uh, marketing uh, second uh, marketing uh, of property third is accepting letter offer uh, five signing of SPA uh, no, uh, sorry, uh, four is signing of SPA, five handover of uh, property that's been a handover of keys. Hence, uh, from that, we know that uh, the processing lawyer not so easy, uh, maybe not suitable, uh, do it by uh, ourselves <coughs> uh, without hiring lawyer to do uh, pro process um, as per uh, standard procedure, right? Okay, um, move. Uh, to the reason why we need the convincing lawyer to sell our uh, property. There are three reasons why we need a, a lawyer to uh, sell our property. First of all, as we know, the knowledge and uh, as expertise is so important to do with uh, everything, especially selling the property. The selling uh, property required a legal document and convincing lawyer is someone is a uh, uh, is licensed to uh, guide seller and buyer uh, to uh, through the legal aspect of a same property and uh, transparent ownership differ then convincer convincer maybe knowledge is uh, in property selling as has gone uh, by uh, through training but convincing lawyer uh, spend year and year um, with um, year and year of uh, study uh, in the legal department and will be able to take care of the uh, legal matter legal matter or legal, uh, legal documents also they are so expert in the legal field and able to guide us uh, through and uh, efficiently so lawyer capability and knowledge are more reliable okay um let's move to second uh, reason because of cost uh, efficiency uh, the customer of course need the lower cost increase right most people will not hire lawyer uh, when selling the property because they will have to pay for uh, expensive services for a lawyer yes that's right the cost of higher uh, higher lawyer not so cheap but we need to know we need to know that the uh, processing not so easy and maybe not suitable uh, to do it by yourself without hiring the lawyer uh, <coughs> as uh, to proceed as per standard procedure. Therefore, uh, <coughs> here uh, different between the coincer. <coughs> okay, um, 
So, uh, the point between coincy and coincy lawyer uh, is coincy does not have capability, uh, capability to make uh, to make any uh, legal advice uh, different than a coincy lawyer. Uh, <coughs> therefore, the coincy will have to hire a uh, lawyer uh, to to do it the uh, legal advice. In the end, the fees that one must pay to hire a lawyer might might up a less compared to a coincer. So of course we choose coincer lawyer, right? Okay, uh, we move on. The last uh, reason is uh, to protect uh, the lawyer. A uh, lawyer able to guide uh, uh, us to uh, through this uh, legal uh, step to sell our property and to avoid uh, any fault. Uh, the appointed lawyer will ensure the process sale of property and will uh, make sure the purchase price is protected and uh, safe, uh, safely and secure until the end of sunset, sun transaction. Uh, also, uh, will protect the uh, seller to charge any late payment delay in event of the uh, buyer is delayed in completing SFP. Thus, for, con uh, in, uh, for conclusion is uh, hiring the best lawyer uh, is the best because uh, it will uh, save a lot of uh, trouble uh, to save from uh, paying unnecessary costs as they are uh, professional in the field and they able to guide us um, or to guide the seller and buyer uh, uh, from common mistake that people make during an ownership transfer, we need to hire them. Thank you from me. Assalamualaikum. That's all.